good morning and welcome back again to another amazing amazing video i just woke up it's like 704 so yeah come with me i'm leaving my bedroom now okay now guys i told you guys yesterday that i didn't know what this is for i think it took me 24 hours to realize that it's a place it's a sitting room to watch tv i'm like how didn't i get this am i an alien Let's go outside. Ooh, it's cloudy. Interesting. The name of the place that I'm staying is Mizengini. Uh, River Front Hotel. Um, this whole place is fully paid for by content creation, guys. I'm telling you guys, I'm not saying this to flex or anything. It's just like, I'm like, bro, do you know you can just travel around the world for free just because you decided to press record that's all i'm saying guys like it's no brainer bro me being in this country everything is just paid for because i'm a content creator i bring value to the table i get some things for free that's the benefit of being a content creator on the other hand i could decide to go do a nine to five and then anytime i want to live this kind of life i have to pay for it you know everything I have to pay for it which probably I could I can't afford how many times do you guys get to experience things like this those who do 95 not much maybe twice maximum a year but if you're a content creator you might end up doing like four five times a year you know that's the advantage the benefit uh, there's a pool area here good morning Good morning, how are you? I'm good, how are you? Are you okay? Yes. You sleep well? Yes, good morning, thank sir. you. It's okay. I sleep very well. Good. Thank you. Uh, now, the, um, the staff here are very nice, you know. Anytime I wake up, they say, hey, how are you? Did you sleep well? It's a good thing. All right, so I'm early to breakfast because I just, I was awake from like four. 4 a.m. I did everything I'm supposed to do. I'm like, let's, let's just go outside. So, I stepped out. So, there you go. Breakfast is ready. Hello, good morning. This is what we're having. Those juices, isn't it? Ready. All right. Morning, how are you? You guys know how much I love that. What I have here for breakfast, I might go back in to get some, you know, different whatever. But in the meantime, this is what I have, and I'm eating breakfast with this view, right? Looking at boats and ships and yachts and blue ocean, coconut trees, like, you know, this is, this is pretty interesting, if you ask me. Um, and just, it's, it's fully paid for by content creation. I'm not throwing any shade, but it's just, I'm just pointing out the obvious. This picture was taken last year, when I was in Zanzibar, at a rock um, restaurant. And because I've been there, I really don't feel the urge to go back there anymore. But it was really nice. Their food, their seafood is crazy. Like one plate of seafood, like to be able to eat something very nice at a rock, rock restaurant, the minimum you can spend, something really nice. I mean, there are other cheaper options, but if you really want to have a good time, the minimum you can spend is like $100, which it's not that bad because even in my country, in Ghana, I'll probably spend more than that. So, yo, take a look. You see that ferry there? It's so fast, it's crazy. That's what I used the first time I was coming to Zanzibar. I went to Dar es Salaam and then took the ferry to Zanzibar. 
this time I use flight. In the middle of the ocean, it's like very, it's a sticky one. It's very heavy. It swings the boats left and right, but I think the captain is very good. Anyways, what's the agenda for today? Today I'm changing Airbnb hotel. I'm leaving the hotel that I'm living in into an apartment. So the person I'm going, I'm coming to see here is called Max Maxwell. And he's an African-American who relocated from America to Dubai and, and technically Africa because he has a property here and then he's building more properties here. And I'm here for him. So today I'm going to be transferred from this hotel to his apartment. Um, so that's where I'll be living for the rest of my days here in Zanzibar. And as soon as we're done, we, we're supposed to record a video, maybe today or tomorrow, um, about why he decided to, you know, move and why he chose Zanzibar, Tanzania, out of all the countries in Africa. So I'm looking forward to it. Um, so yeah, that's the agenda for today. And as soon as I'm done with what I'm supposed to do, probably just go for, um, there's something called Safari Blue. It's basically riding on the boat with like a bunch of other people with fruit, food, seafood, all this type of nice fancy food and diving into the sunset and then really enjoying yourself with music and everything and last time I was in Zanzibar I wasn't able to do it so I'm like you know what this time let me just do it so I might be able to do that today if not then tomorrow um, and then also going to Menemba Island this island is just very small and when it's low tide you can see you can literally stand on the island but when it's high tide the island just disappear um, I don't know how safe that is but we will try that out maybe today or tomorrow um, these two things before I leave yesterday we went to the caves uh, we went to the slave dungeons here in Zanzibar nobody really know about um, listen the cave was it's an adventure guys it's not easy I barely breath a breath in there it was crazy but I hope you watched that video and if you did give it a thumbs up let me know what you guys think and yeah enjoy me enjoy watching me eat now I wouldn't recommend this eating and filming yourself because sometimes I'm very hungry or I'm trying to lose weight I'm home and I see people eat online and I, I just I hate it I'm like damn I'm trying to lose weight and these people are eating and now I want to go eat so if you are losing weight please don't watch me but for some reason if you like watching people eat you're welcome Back to the same place I was listening. You know, I just had a, a text from Max. I'm gonna meet him like in the next 30 an hour. And then start with the day. One thing I really learned about Max or oh, learned from him is speed. Speed, success not speed. You know, he does everything quick, fast, fast, fast. Um, if you really want to be successful, you can't just be procrastinating and stuff. So then, procrastinating is like so expensive, you can't afford it. So, that's what I mean. Speak, do everything quick, fast, fast, fast. Don't slow down. hotel and listen it looks good out here man and it's too bright bro I can't take off my glasses I can't see I'll be squeezing my eye like that it's too bright out here so like the shades come in handy uh, there's a boat right there you know huge boat this is what I used the last time I was in Zanzibar from Dar es Salaam so and it it's really fast just so you know and as I was telling you guys, I really appreciate it. I love this experience using this boat to Zanzibar than using flight because it's so windy. Oh, and see who just pulled up. <laughs> Yo, good? good. Damn, that's a beast, bro. What? Fire hole, bro. 
That's a machine right there. So I'm here with, um, he said, diver. Uh, he dive, he goes down the ocean, seeing fishes and whatever. I'm gonna ask him how he, how he does it. So he goes by the name, what's your name? My name is Yuma. It's Yuma. Yeah. How long have you been a diver? Uh, around the two years now. Two years, oh, okay, nice. Interesting. Yeah, Whoa. I am a scuba diver. Mm. Yeah, only... How did you learn? Yes. Mm -hmm. How did you learn? Uh, I learned in Nemba. Okay. Yeah. And uh, he, they gave me many... Many... Uh, Lessons? Yeah. Until now. First, I have tried to swim me alone without anyone teaching yeah mm -hmm. just it for myself after that then i've gone there mm -hmm. yeah okay. until now I, i'm still alive okay yeah. you are born in zanzibar yeah what you like what do you like the most about your country uh nice mm -hmm. island and uh, people are very polite mm, yeah. polite and kind yeah no corruption mm -hmm. yeah mm -hmm. i can say that um in zanzibar they are really nice people almost like how Ghanaians are so i think it's a good thing Ghanaians are very kind and nice just like zanzibar people oh. we're on the boat right now checking out this boat Objects here there at the back. I see. Um, this opens. Yeah. There's, there's a room in there. There's three rooms in there. It's just it's locked now. The guy's left. He just left right now. I see. So how much will it cost to rent this for the like day? Privately owned. Five what? No, it's privately owned. Privately owned. Okay. Yeah. Unless someone is willing to like borrow it. Yes, long as both. Boat. That's a nice boat, man. We out here, man. Are you ready to throw Zanzibar? Yeah, bro. Are you sure? Show me what you got. Oh, Rafiki, Karibu, Zanzibar. Rafiki, Karibu, Zanzibar. Let's go. And this is the Pirates of the Caribbeans. This is the ship they use. <laughs> Jack, what's his name? Jack, Jack Sparrow. Yeah, Jack Sparrow, yeah. <laughs> Uh, that looks very sophisticated though. Yeah. Maintain that boat. Yeah. Let me go close. So this is the same as the boat they use in that movie, man. Oh yeah. It's nice, man. You can do that by the luxury way or the affordable way. It's your choice, your call. If you got the money, you can have a good experience. 
Yo, my G, what's good? the whole Patco team here now if you guys are watching this we have a main video coming up on Web Nation Africa so go check it out but yeah right now we're just trying to go on a boat right now we are with a team right here that's Maxwell that's uh, Abu right yeah boy. and then him and we have Barak Barak and Maxwell we're so excited we're going to see how the dredging yeah. has been done how to make a land yeah you know what I'm talking about making land out of nowhere literally by digging the sand out of the below the water whatever you call it so we're going to watch how it's done so enjoy what happens bro i'm coming bro i'm coming with the jet i'm coming with the jet do you know how to ride it? Huh? Just feet? Yeah, bro. It's easy. Easy? Yeah, it's just like... What if it flips thing. over? Uh, you know it flips over too, yeah, right? Yeah, I know how to swim. You do? Yeah. Okay. Bro, I'm... I'm, I'm on. There's no Zanzibar who doesn't know how to swim. You can't swim, yeah? Yeah, the only Zanzibar who doesn't know how to swim is Mouse. You know this guy called Mouse? Oh, no. <laughs> the only Zanzibar who doesn't It keeps going far away. You can come in. Good? Yeah. Please, huh? they are crying for the, they are, they are They are both, they say it's too clean. Don't be angry, huh? Okay, let's, let me use that route. Oh, it keeps going far away. Damn. Yeah, I'm holding it. It keeps going far, man. With the come, 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 you are the boss. Yeah. All, <laughs> everybody here is boss. Thank you, man. This is Vibarua. No, Vibarua. They were Vibarua. Captain Abbas. Yeah, I'm here.
very huge uncle, man. Thank you. 